curtail the tape for this, our main event of the evening. More than five years apart, and they both possess a similar height and reach. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. <laughs> This man is a judo fighter, holding a professional record of 34 wins, 10 losses, one draw, and two no contests. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Coconut Creek, Paloma, Hector This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California. Bruce, the dragon, Lee! You've been giving your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time. And it is gonna go down right now. We are underway. Well, what a visual this is. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one. The founding father of modern mixed martial arts. It's hard to simulate his speed his striking in training. And I think that's something that has been a big focus for the opponent coming in here tonight. Quick with his hands, quick with his feet, and obviously a guy who gets off to a very good start more often than not. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lombard. Lee gets hit by that kick to the body. Eats a, a nice right hand. Takes him down early here, Joe. No surprise. Very evident he wants this fight on the mat. Effective strike there by Lombo. Misses again with a right punch. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Going orthodox now. Excellent knee to the body. And he connects with the punch there. Lombard gets absolutely melted by that hit kick. He switched stances back to southpaw here. Lands an outside leg kick of his own. Big combination big there. Another shot. Take down Lance. Good 
shot from the front. Maintaining control in the top position. Good work, I'm gonna stand this up. They're canceling each other out. Ninety seconds to go in round one. Switching stances here. There's a single attempt. Oh, and he lands another takedown there. He's already landed several in the fight and really doing a great job with these takedowns, not telegraphing his shot back to the Working canvas. The choke here. Here, trying to get that arm underneath the back of the neck. Nicely done. Under a minute to go in the round. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Oh, reversal. Controlling him from behind. Half guard here. Moves into full mount here. Look at this. He's out of it. He's got full guard here. 30 seconds now to go in round one. He moved his right foot forward, back to southpaw. Yeah, and here he goes again. Gets the takedown late in the round here, Joe. You see a lot of fighters do that to try to maybe swing the judges in their favor. Very big moment for him here late round one. Guillotine attempt. one on guillotine here. Round two next. Here we see some beautiful technique executing this submission, but doesn't quite pull it off. And there's another excellent attempt at the submission, but can't quite finish it. And here is one more submission attempt. It looked very tight. Here we are, early round two. Look for him to go on the attack early in this round, try to pick up where he left off in the last round. His opponent was dazed and in big trouble when that round ended. How about that shot? Lee's head kick attempt, that one is great. Hard right to the body. Big punches. Oh. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Oh, he got reversed. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. It looks to me like he's trying to turn towards either side. Big punch from the bottom. Attacking the arm here. He's got the arm here. Now he's going to throw his leg over. And he escaped the arm bar. Hip escape, nice hip escape. And he's trapped in half guard here. Slides him over, and nice reversal here. Well, pretty good work off of the bottom here by Lombo. He's trying to pass here. Three minutes and change to go in round two. He's 
mounted. He's got to hang on and keep control of his posture. Elbow to the head there by Longo. TKO victory. He was not intelligently defending himself. Nice victory. Well, Joe, I'm glad you lauded the stoppage by the referee because these guys do not get enough credit and the fighter was not effectively defending themselves. You have to intelligently defend the offense coming your way and once some real damage was being inflicted, it became a dangerous situation. So good call by the official there. Let's look at that from a different angle. We can see it here from another angle. One after another, these strikes land until the referee has seen enough. So a big win for him here tonight, and he made an even bigger statement by getting it by TKO. All right, we said it.